Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to be recommending some uh, romance books. Uh, so I love reading romance books. When I read high fantasy and many thrillers, I need books that have less stakes, low stakes. So these books deliver that uh, because you know romance books are pretty predictable like you know that two people meet each other and they fall in love then something happens and they separate and at last they will get back together so yeah these are like pretty low stakes and you can just relax and have fun reading these books so i'm gonna be recommending some of the romance books here so please keep on watching the first book that i want to recommend is the kiss quotient by helen hong so in this we follow stella lane who uh, wants to date and settle but she she is very awkward to date people and she doesn't know how to be a girlfriend so she takes help she books a, a male escort and yeah to help her uh, find out figure out how to be a good girlfriend so we also follow michael um, who you know who is in need of cash and he uses his good looks to earn some more cash so that's how they meet and after that i I don't think I should say any more because you will be able to predict things. So yeah, this was really good, uh, really steamy and um, yeah, very entertaining. So I highly recommend reading this book. The next book that I want to recommend is The Love Hypothesis by Ali Hazelwood. So in this we follow Olive um, whose friend wants to date Olive's ex-boyfriend but she... Um, She's still thinking that Olive is still hung up on him. So to prove her friend that she has moved on, Olive kisses the first guy she sees on campus and that is Professor Adam Carlson. So yeah, this was very entertaining. It wasn't very fast paced, but um, it's still very entertaining. So yeah, I highly recommend this one. The next book that I want to recommend is The Spanish Love Deception by Elena Armas. So in this we follow Catalina who has promised her family that she would get her date to her sister's wedding but the catch is that she doesn't have a boyfriend. Um, when her nemesis, uh, what's his name, um, Aaron Blackford offers to come with her, she is skeptical because she doesn't know if, she, if he has any inferior motive to come with her. But yeah, she agrees and yeah, it's a very slow burn romance. And uh, even though it is slow burn, it's very entertaining and I love this book. I love the writing style and yeah, highly, highly recommend this one. I know that there is mixed opinions about this book. Many people hate this, many people love this, but I am in the love category. I love this book. I love the writing style. I love everything about this book. So I highly recommend this one. The next book is It Happened One Summer by Tessa Bailey. So in this we follow Piper who has a reputation of being a wild child and one day she drinks and does something um, which makes her um, stepdad to cut her off uh, from his you know property and money. So she's sent to this place where she uh, you know gets to know her real dad and that's when she meets um, a fisherman named Brendan and yeah the character development in this book is amazing so i loved reading about that and it was really entertaining and i highly recommend this one i really love tessa bailey's writing style i can't wait to read more books by her the next book is one of my favorites that is better than the movies by lynn painter so in this we follow liz who uh, wants to impress michael her crush so she takes help uh, of wes bennett um, who is her, you know, uh, neighbor come nemesis. Yeah, so that's all I can say about this book. This was so fun, so entertaining. I laughed so much reading this book. This was purely young adult, so it's very easy to read um, and very entertaining. I can say only that much. So I highly, highly recommend this one. Lastly, we have The Deal by Al Kennedy. I think the storyline of this is very similar to um, Better Than The Movies, but this is highly like, this is purely young adult, whereas this is um, kind of adult. Um, yeah, in this we follow Hannah who wants to impress her crush. So she takes help from this um, um, professional uh, hockey player that is uh, Garrett Graham. So yeah, they fall in love obviously. So. 
yeah this was a little adult and it has steamy uh, scenes as well so it was very entertaining i loved the book i have read i think all the um L Kennedy off campus books and also there is also one more series Briar U series i have read all the books in that series as well i highly recommend this one so these are the books romance books i highly recommend please read these these will uh, you know make you feel good and uh, yeah these are very entertaining first of all and they can help you relax so yeah thank you for watching this video if you like this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon so you get notifications on more videos thank you bye bye